Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary channel, which is the build 25357. As we're used to, Microsoft releases these Canary channel builds alongside with the dev channel so far, and the Canary channel builds are builds that have limited documentation and are smaller compared to the dev channel ones. Well, in this video, we're gonna talk about what is new and what has changed in this newest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary channel. Also, we're gonna mention some features that were also removed temporarily from this version. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, we have the new Facebook widget inside the Canary channel. To enable it, all you need to do is to go into the store app and first of all, install the Facebook app on your computer. Search for it in the search box, click on install to install it. Of course, wait a few seconds and then we're going to be able to add it inside the widget section and after the Facebook app is installed you can open the widget section and then click on the plus button you're also gonna notice the new widgets picker if you have it enabled and the new Facebook widget that you can click on you can click on pin to pin it inside your widget section of course you're gonna have to set up your account and so on but I'm not gonna do that in this video and the other feature that we can get in the canary channel is that the new volume mixer is official inside the canary channel so I think this is a stable and tested version of the new volume mixer for Microsoft and I think that is really really nice it can be opened inside the quick settings section and on this button near the sound slider and you have at the top output devices spatial sound and the volume mixer of course which can help you set volumes for each and every application that you have currently opened on your system and you also have more volume settings and a settings button that will open the volume mixer inside the settings app which also helps you select certain audio ranges for different apps. I think this is really, really nice. And we also have two new features that are removed temporarily from the Canary channel, which is the new PCA UI and also the new settings dialogues are temporarily removed from this Canary channel build. Thank you to Phantom Motion 3 for providing this information. So this is it basically in the Canary channel. As I've said, Canary channel builds are smaller, but we'll have maybe more interesting new features being tested in this channel. But for me, the fact that we have the new volume mix inside this channel is great news for Windows 11 users so make sure to leave a comment below stating your opinion on that if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one I was Emmanuel from tech base until next time have a nice day